Good morning guys. So today is a new day. I'm doing a super quick intro because my mom's boyfriend Luke asked me if I would be in a commercial for him because he films commercials for like a car dealership up here. So that's what we're doing. He's over there with his camera. Hi Fifi. Okay. watching some of the footage back. If any of you guys live in Utah, maybe you'll see this on TV. Good morning, guys. So it is a little later in the day. It's about 10.30. Uh, the past couple weeks I've been feeling kind of sick and today is like the worst day of it all. I have a lot of stuff that I have to get done on the computer, just a bunch of busy work. So I'm gonna be sitting here for the next couple hours. now to shoot the second part of the commercial. I'll let you guys know like when and if this actually makes it to TV. <laughs> what, if he, it to what if he hates it though? He's not gonna hate it. Oh, I don't know. You'll probably maybe only see it if you live in Utah, but you know. I'm sure you can get a copy of it. I'll put it like in the vlog or something. You want me to do like a picture of me taking it for her? No, she, okay. can, she can do it. A selfie, like yeah. No, 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 not at all. I'll be good. It is so cold here. What's the temperature? 33? Pretty sure it's, it's like not even negative. That cold. <laughs> we just finished. Oh, you should have worn that coat. Oh, I should have. And the beanie. Here. Oh, I would have looked so much cuter. This is like the only actual outfit that I brought. All the other stuff I have is like leggings and like one shirt. But we just finished doing that. We're not totally done yet. It was just like a little local TV thing. So that's actually going to be on TV. <laughs> yeah. Where do you think it's going to be? I don't know. I never really thought about it. Because Luke does like all the commercials for the They're all on TV. car places, but I never thought about where they are. <laughs> They're like where they go. Now we're going lunch. So I've been sitting at home all day doing stupid computer busy work. So I decided to get out and take the truck for a drive. So on this drive, I came to the spot where I had a half pipe built. Me and Sean Duris, if you guys remember that video, we built this half pipe right here. The weirdest thing, this is where one half of the half pipe is and the other half is over there. I'm guessing that the wind probably blew it. I doubt that someone would just throw it like that. I thought that someone would have burned it by now. I'm surprised that those are still here. You have some fans in the comments. Everyone thinks Toma. Hold on, I gotta fix my had, hair. Oh my I god. I can see it, <laughs> and sometimes it throws me off. They said you had a glow up, or I whatever did. that, yeah. however you use that phrase. You did? You agree? Mm -hmm. Do you have anything you want to say to the ladies? Who no. knows? <laughs> No? <laughs> no? I don't know. What would I say? But hey, I'm Toma. Hey. I go to the U. Yeah. Hit it's me true. Up. Yep. Toma goes to the U. If you see me on campus, so that's me. <laughs> that's him. This truck has like this special feature that you can like crawl up stuff. I, don't, I haven't even used it yet. I'm about to use it for the first time. <laughs> back home now. Evie is seriously driving me insane. My mom and Luke trained her to ring this little bell right here. So it's on a string connected to the door. There's a bell. So what's supposed to happen is that anytime she needs to go to the bathroom, she's supposed to ring the bell so that they know. So they let her outside, she goes to the bathroom, and then she comes back in. But what Evie likes to do is ring the bell a thousand times a day for no reason. It's literally snowing outside, and she likes to just go out there for like hours on end and play. But obviously, like, 
you can't just leave her out there like unsupervised you have to be like watching but she likes to go out there a thousand times a day she likes to go play with the neighbor's dog and cat but the neighbor's dog and cat don't even like her so she's constantly trying to like go outside and play with her friends and her friends anytime she goes out there are just like so she's inside now hi evie she's cute but she's vicious she literally smells like nasty wet dog and i'm sitting here i'm actually editing this vlog i was dumb and i made the intro on my computer and i used like a plug-in so it basically has to be on my computer to like edit the intro also there's been a couple days where i've forgotten to change the date i think there's only been two days and one time i swear i changed the date but it was not changed it said one and then the other time i did forget to change it but i always think it's funny when people ask like why does it say day one it says that because i forgot to change it like wh what other like why else would it say that i don't know but anyways i've been having to edit all the vlogs except parker does edit his footage and like send it to me so that i don't have to cut through it all but since i was dumb and made that intro thing on my computer it's just hard to like change it to Parker's because you have to like not have it exported so you can change the date blah 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 so I've been the one editing the vlogs even though Parker usually edits them but I'm trying to edit and I'm just distracted by the smell of what dog who went and played in the snow did you have fun did you wouldn't it be weird if dogs could talk? So when we got our house decorated, one of the things that kind of was, we were kind of iffy about was getting all of these like real plants all over the place because we are gone a lot and they have to be watered. I bought Aspen a, one of these. I bought Aspen this. Aspen is in Salt Lake so she can't water her plants. She asked me to be the father of her plants and help take care of them and water them. I have a lot of plants to get watered. Oh. oh wait psych that's a fake plant <laughs> dang it that one doesn't have like a pot on the bottom of it so all the water just ran right through it so fast forward a few hours our closet is always covered in clothes on the bottom covered covered in clothes whenever i get home from a trip i never want to unpack right when i get home from a trip i don't know why i just like to throw my suitcase in here and dig clothes out of it for a couple days until i decide to put it all away today is that day i am going to clean up and unpack my stuff from when i went to salt lake Alright, so that is gonna be it for the vlog today. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. I hope that you guys have been enjoying Vlogmas. It's been a lot of fun putting up a video every single day. We're really enjoying it. I hope that it's been fun to see these vlogs where Aspen's up in Salt Lake and I'm down here. So we're kind of doing completely separate things. I'm enjoying it. It's really fun to be able to watch the video and see what Aspen's been doing. If you guys are enjoying these Vlogmas vlogs, make sure to give it a big thumbs up and hit the subscribe button. Who knows, maybe we will continue doing daily vlogs after Vlogmas. I doubt that would really happen, but what if, guys, what if? Yeah, so we will see you guys in tomorrow's vlog. Bye, guys. Thank you.